A dangerous opioid suspected in the deaths of three men in San Francisco's Haight-Ashbury neighborhood. Their bodies were found outside the Urban School on Page Street about 4.30 this morning. KPI X5 reporter Betty Yu live at the health department with concerns about the men's deaths. Betty? Alan, the San Francisco Public Health Department does not know the exact cause of death at this time, but they say the fact that these three people died all at once near each other and near drugs is highly unusual in this city, and that's why they suspect fentanyl is to blame. It's really important for people to know that if you buy drugs on the street, they can be contaminated with fentanyl. And it's very easy to overdose with fentanyl. We do not yet know the identity of the three men who died on the sidewalk outside of Haight Ashbury's urban school overnight. But we now have a suspect in their deaths fentanyl, a powerful opioid that often kills before emergency responders even have a chance to help. If we are lucky enough to be able to bring them back to the point where they can tell us what happened, uh, they'll say, I took a pill and it looks exactly like my other pills. A tiny amount, those grains beside the dime, can kill. And that danger is multiplied by the fact that it is often hidden in other drugs. In fact, labs across California are now seeing all kinds of samples that contain fentanyl. We have found them in pills, in powders, solids. And whether it's an obvious street drug like heroin or a pill that looks like a pharmaceutical product, there's no way to tell just by looking at it. Some of our analysts with over 20 years of experience were saying these look completely legitimate. So tonight the health department is reaching out to facilities like the Haight-Ashbury Free Clinic, alerting them to the three deaths and the danger of a potentially lethal drug that often comes very cheap cheaper. Um, fentanyl is cheaper than heroin, and so it could be laced uh, into the opiate uh, or the opioid um, formulations. And the health department is stressing that the best way to save lives is for drug users to always carry Narcan. It's a nasal spray that can reverse overdoses, and it's available at pharmacies in some cases without a prescription. Live in San Francisco, Betty Yu, KPIX 5.